We now have Sister Kathleen Go to bring us the details of the Amateur Radio and VoIP Interactive Seminar in the District of British Columbia. As part of the ongoing celebration marking the Iglesia Ni Cristo's 110th anniversary, members from the District of British Columbia took part in an amateur radio and VOIP interactive activity. Yes, our celebration, the amateur radio and uh, VOIP uh, interactive. Uh, this one that's uh, going to be help us to improve our uh, knowledge, all kind of uh, communication that we use in uh, Scan International. The brethren demonstrated their unity with the church administration as they take part in the activity that aims to orient them on how amateur radio and VOIP help Scan members in fulfilling their duty. What I learned is, of so course, it's always good to have a refresher uh, yes using our no. radio and using the, uh, Going to the tennis, more advanced technology, uh, digital radio as we called it. Heart. Also, um, so may we make our refreshing our tennis. uniform types and, also support and our how to use in the stand radio prof so that we uh, professionally the giving, uh, the or the right way to, uh, to use a radio. The event, which was conducted outdoor with a nice summer heat, saw enthusiastic participation from members of all ages. In the said activity, members learned not only how amateur radio works, but also the importance of first aid in times of emergency, as well as the necessity of wearing safety equipment in times of disaster. So I learned uh, how to use a proper communication using the ham radio, uh, using the Zello, and how to do the first aid as well. It is clear to all attendees the importance of uniting with the church administration in all the activities they launch. Members do not just learn additional information and knowledge, but most importantly, in fulfillment of God's commands of always excelling in the Lord's work. It's very important to attend to all the activities that are uh, conducted in the Church of Christ because uh, in this way that we prove to our Almighty God that we submit ourselves to the Church administration to the leadership of Brother Eduardo V. Manalo. Brethren from the District of British Columbia are very thankful to the Church administration for always looking after their spiritual welfare guiding them to reach the perfection of their fate. When it comes to radio and communication devices, which is an important tool when it comes to safety. It is important for the members of the Church of Christ to unite in all the activities launched by the church administration because through these activities, our skills are being honed and also the harmony and collaboration between brethren are being strengthened and developed. So, providing a harmonious environment to each of us. From the District of British Columbia, Canada, I am Sister Kathleen Ga for the Iglesia Ni Cristo News Network.